Hello folks, this is Vagrant and welcome to basically day three here on Animal Crossing, on Twin Peaks in Animal Crossing. This should be the day where, well by the looks of it the museum's not finished, but it's definitely in progress. I was kind of hoping it would be finished, but we'll see what happens. Let's talk to Tom, he's doing his little morning announcement. Some study news just in, we're moving forward to construction of the Twin Peaks Museum. Now, if Blav is not, I imagine we'll be getting ready to build a museum on his very first day on the island. We're very grateful for everyone's cooperation. Anywho, we started construction for the museum at the very spot where Blav has had his tent. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> One more day. I'll show you why this is an issue. <laughs> but, um, that's okay. So, tomorrow is museum day. Tomorrow is museum day. Yep, Timmy and Tommy have opened the new shop. This should be pretty cool. We placed that, I think, in the last video. Maybe the video before. And then we had to gather 30 of all the different types of wood and 30 iron nuggets, which was definitely the harder part. But we did that in day one as well, so very efficient. Cool, so we should have more things available now. It is... Ah, this is, this is the one thing I was worried about. It is limited in when you can sell stuff. And I think we can no longer sell stuff at the tent where we have been. Now, you could do that 24-7. So... Hmm. Drop off anything you don't need. They send payments to your account. Don't they take 20%? You're going to talk about that, Tom? You're not going to talk about that, Tom. <laughs> okay. Oh, cool. Nook's Cranny. Whenever we cover big gallon developments like this, we'll hold a special commemorative ceremony afterwards. <gasps> Yes, I am interested. I want to have a little party. I want to. I want a party. You're having a phone call, Tom. This is very unprofessional. I'm just saying. <laughs> the getaway package. Aww. Oh, do we have someone else coming to the island? Is that who he's talking to? Because we had the getaway package, and that's how we ended up here in the first place. Mm, maybe. Oh, wait, yeah, so I should show you this. This is um, new. <laughs> I have decorated somewhat. Some of my trees have grown a little bit, some haven't. So I don't have access to fences or even path yet. This isn't actually a path. This is a little pattern I made in my, if we go into here, into the, um, the custom designs, as you can see just sort of made it, it's very simple obviously, and put it on the ground and it kind of looks like path. The more I look at it, the more the less I like it, but it has definitely made a nice difference to the overall look of my house. So the house is over here now, the fire, we've got a little seat to, you know, maybe do some fishing, chill by the fire, and because we don't have any fences, I decided to plant spruce all the way along here, and the spruce is kind of going to be my fence. Now, we're going to check our mail and then we're going to look at the thing that you just saw. <laughs> Let's open this up from Daisy May. That's my only new one, right? Yeah. I'll be heading to your island every Sunday morning to sell my precious turnips. It's Monday! No, Daisy May, I wanted the turnips. We were a day late. I saw loads of people had turnips. Apparently they're like really good value, so I've seen people posting about them, and we now have to wait a week. So I got some new fish. This little boy here, I say little boy, is a football fish. Now as it happens, I've gathered like six of them since I did this first one, but that is our football fish. Uh, very cool. Otherwise known as an anglerfish. I think a football fish is a specific species of anglerfish, which is a family rather than a species. Over here we have... what are you? Oh, I think this is actually another... yeah, that's actually another football fish, um, because this is the one we're going to put in the museum, but I really, really like it. Uh, let's put it back down. So, being because of this, so if we click, boop, I'll, I'll do that. Click. You can see when you turn the light on, it's little, boop, 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 it's little lantern comes on. Or lantern fish, if that's what you call them. Whatever. There's lots of different names. Boop, boop. And I really want to keep one for my house at some point. So I've kept two. One's going to the museum and one is eventually going inside the house. Speaking of which, let's, let's pick it up. Uh, a couple of these are pear trees. We've got some pear trees from the pears that Mama sent us. A couple of cedars, well, cedar in the middle, and then two normal trees in the front. Just, just to mix things up. Got some varied flower colourings going on. Just, just wanting things to be pretty. The outside is looking pretty nice. And 
then you get inside and it still sort of looks like I'm a hoarder, essentially. There's plenty of fish and spiders and snails they're all going obviously in the um in the museum when it does eventually open tomorrow. This is the main reason I want the museum to open. I want I want to sleep in my house again. <laughs> Not sleep in this hellscape full of um spiders. Now I'm gonna do something over here. We've got a tire. You just fish these up randomly, you know. I just I picked it up last night. I went on a big fishing expedition last night. I did tons of fishing, about three hours of just solid fishing last night. I was trying to get a coelacanth, which is like this long-standing, really super rare Animal Crossing fish. You can only get it in the rain. It was raining last night, so I went for it. And I didn't get a coelacanth, but I did get something pretty cool. I'll show you in a second. And um, but I also got a tire. Now tires can be turned into toys. Which is this, by the way. This is what counts as a tire toy. <laughs> it's literally half a tire on the ground. But, oh no, I'm stuck somehow. Oh no. Oh no, the tire toy has betrayed me. How did I get in? Oh, there we go. But apparently, if you leave junk on the ground, so that's tires, boots, cans, stuff like that, uh, flies will buzz around, and that's how we're going to add a fly to our collection. So, there we go. Now, one more thing to show you, which is this big boy over here, and there he is. That is my ore fish. Definitely the rarest fish I've found so far. Absolute unit of a fish. I'm hoping, hello, <laughs> you'll get a bit of a better view when we get to the museum, but that's that's not bad right there. You can get a good look at him. There, he's absolutely humongous. Got him last night. Super, super happy about that. I tell you what, if we hop into our Critopedia, I can show you a slightly better look at him straight away. We're not doing bad. Rashi, I'm only missing, I think... A couple of fish now, and a couple of insects that I know are gettable at this point in time. I did also get killed by a tarantula last night, unfortunately. There he is, look at him, isn't he a beauty? Available all day, just caught him in the rain. I just think he's rare, more than anything, yeah. So, yeah, got him. Um, we're going to go take him inside as well. Very excited to put him in the museum, but we'll have to wait until tomorrow. Given he is such a unit, however, the museum must be massive, right? We're about to put like 20 different animals in, and as far as we know, they've got like a proper aquarium sort of section. Hopefully, well, we're going to see that tomorrow. That's really cool. Let's put him away for now. I shall name him Jerome. Jerome's a cool name. Ah, life. Anyways, what are we doing? What are we doing? Oh, yeah, there's my, there's my birdhouse. So this is, this is Shay, wait, no, Casa de Rudiger. <laughs> oh, yeah, pretty happy with it. It's looking good. Right then, we have things to do. It is a brand new shiny day. Oh, they've got a house as well. Oh, this is nicer. Why is, it, why is your house nicer than mine? Pashmina. Oh, she's got a little. She's got a little um, cat flap. Hey, why has she got a nicer house than me? <laughs> What's going on here, Tom? There we go. There's the museum in development. There's um, where say the girl from stocking gold. Oh, I need the guppy as well. I forgot about the guppy. Oh, now I'm sad again. I have to catch a guppy. Uh, the government's stocking all our animals around the museum, ready for when it opens tomorrow. And we'll fill that in. Right, let's nip into services. What have I got on me? Absolutely not Dickens. We might have to come back a little bit later on in the day when the shop opens. Hey, Tom! Oh, wants to have a word. Don't worry about a thing. Don't worry. Oh, there's something else I need to do. Lots of things to do. Lots of things to do. Are you not in room with Tommy boy? Whittaker, sorry to keep you waiting. I did, Tom. I did. Okay. Three interested parties. Very cool. Wait, I wonder who they are. We talked to two other animals to invite them to the island. I wonder who the third is. None of our applicants are too fond of the notion of sleeping in tents. Oh, that's fair enough. <laughs> Fully finished him. Okay. Free home set inside the land preparing all the furniture. It's too much for one raccoon. Somebody in the comment section told me that he wasn't meant to be a raccoon. But he just called himself a raccoon. I'm just saying. <laughs> Maybe visually he's based on something else. A tanuki. I want to Google it. I will, Tommy. I will. I, I, okay. What was? As if I have a choice. <laughs> That's a bit harsh. A tanuki is a Japanese raccoon dog. Which is 
literally a dog. I can see it, to be honest. The visual is very, very, very similar. In a lot of ways. Kind of like the bandit man. Yeah, but it looks like a raccoon as well. He calls himself a raccoon, but going with a raccoon. <laughs> What should I do? <laughs> Agent Knockout. <laughs> do you want me to, you know, slip a trench coat on and beat you in a car park lot or something? Right, it's a new day. Oh yeah, day is yeah, 100 bonus miles, three days in a row. Very cool. Not that I... You know, we, have, we actually have quite a lot of piles right now, as you can see. So what do we need? I'm going to pick up a ticket, because I want to do that today. I want to go, we're going to go explore another island. Thank you, little machine. I think we probably want to save the rest. I don't think there's anything I'm particularly feeling. I'd go for like the hair selections, but I've got a cap that I love. I do like the rugs, but I've got no room. I'm tempted by these, but they don't seem to move, so there's no point in picking them up right now. I do want the nap. I'm going to get the knapsack. I like the knapsack. The knapsack's pretty cool. And then I'm done. Although I'm going to check the other shop as well. <laughs> I know some shops rotate and some don't, essentially. Do I have it on me? No. It seems the Nook Stop always sells the same stuff. Maybe it'll update further on later on, but it's not like a daily rotating shop. Like I believe Nook Shopping is. Oh. Okay. So this is the stuff that you've obtained. So... Oh, this is really cool. Ah, yeah, this is very cool. So anything you've ever found in the world or crafted or whatever like that, this is all the things we've had before. And now we can buy it again. So if you lose it or if you want to buy duplicates or something, as long as you find something once, you can uh, get it again. That's pretty That's pretty nice. Like, maybe I want to do a little display with these plants, but I only ever found one. One dropped out of balloon, so... I wonder if I can't do those again. That was weird, but... Very cool. And then fashion items, again, same idea. Very fashionable, as you can tell. And I don't have... And there's our, our skulls. <laughs> it seems, because I did not find the Brachio skull. I also didn't get it... I've got another fossil. I can't get it analysed. I didn't get it analysed, so it seems... You can um, give items to other players and it'll also register in this database. So really should trade like everything at least once, I guess. Right, and the special goods is just the general stuff. And some of this does rotate, like this stuff wasn't here the other day. Anything cool? Eh, not really. Booty shots. <laughs> uh, okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. Now, just before we go... One more thing, we're going to go to the ABD, which is the bank surface, and as you can see, I have managed to acquire 98,000, but I'm actually loaded right now, I've got like 160,000, and honestly, that's from fishing, you know, I was fishing last night, and I caught a couple of football fish, and a few other things, and I sold like a bag's worth of fish for about 25,000, so, we're going to pay from savings, we're going to give all of it in one big amount, lovely stuff, you capitalist pig, <laughs> Tom. Hooray! I'm no longer saddled with incredible debt. <laughs> Huzzah! Hey, Tommy boy! Let's talk. I have. What if it could be bigger? What if it could be bigger, Tom? What if it could be? Oh, more furniture, more space. I could have a fish room. I would like to hear- Tom? Tom, make me bigger, Tom. <laughs> okay, uh, about my helm. Let's, let's do that first. Get it going, because it'll probably have to, again, take another day to come forward, so. Oh, it's just going to be a room. 198k, oh, Tommy boy. Well, I like the red. I want a different colour. Um, I'm sticking red. Red is just like very nice and classical. Plus it matches my hat. We're going red again. Cool. Brand new home tomorrow. So we're going to get the museum. We're going to donate all our animals tomorrow. And we're going to get a brand new house to check out as well. Tom, what's next? 
A bridge across a river with three homes to build. I worry that will run out of space on land that's easily accessible. Bridge will open things up a bit, make it easier to get to housing plots. Okay. Tommy boy, what are you making me do? Can I have a ceremony? Okay, that's two out of three done. What's the other one? I can do. Yes, let's do it. Let's have a party. It's 6 a.m. Let's get smashed. <laughs> Hair with the dog, all that. Amazing. Absolute rager. Welcome to our dedication ceremony honouring Twin Peaks' brand new Nooks Cranny. Isn't it lovely? I'm the only one that actually claps. It's very weird. I am the one who claps. What are they wearing? <laughs> What are you guys wearing? Like a flannel. <laughs> Is it me? It's me! Anything to add? Woo! <laughs> He's very intense about his wooing. You're, you're welcome. I, I, I meant every O. I really did. <gasps> I want a photo. Continue your growth and celebrate Twin Peaks' beautiful nooks cranny. Hooray! Oh, wait. Is there a photo button? Am I an idiot? Am I an idiot? Oh, there's a photo button! I had no idea! I've only just seen it! <laughs> oh, I've only had no... Oh, I wish I'd got that. I'm a little sad now. Maybe I can have another ceremony. Right, let's go check out nooks whilst we're in the area. So it's shut until 8 a.m. As if not. This is the drop box. So I believe I just basically, yeah, you stick stuff in there and then it sells when the shop opens at 8 a.m. So if you've like run out of storage, this is obviously a lot easier. Now the problem is, I'm going to put my, my dab in there. There we go. The problem is, I believe they take 80%. No, not 80, that would be insane. I believe they take 20% off all the money. So, if you can wait till ATM, obviously that's much better to sell. And this is actually, honestly, it's it's weird, but the shop is a downgrade. Considering my main playing hours like 3 to 4 a.m. in the moment, I play a lot in the middle of the night because I am essentially nocturnal. Um, the shop is literally a downgrade, but there you go. Well, that's our new museum. There is my soon-to-be-upgraded house. I'd like to move it a little bit. It's very close to the, the water's edge, and the problem with that is you can't get behind it. I'm assuming it's not going to get much bigger, though. I'm assuming it's going to look like this, essentially. Now, much to do, much to see. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, it's because we can... Yeah, yeah, I should explain some stuff. We can cut down trees now, which is why I sort of cleared the area out a little bit. If we go into our DIY recipes, I'm going to ignore that for a second. You see, we, I got the upgraded tools thingy, and they're actually not that big a deal to craft. The fishing rod in particular is amazing. You get like two bags worth of fish near enough with the improved fishing rod. It's a huge improvement. Uh, anything else then new? Maybe. God only knows. Right, so, bridge. We need four log stakes, four clay, four stone. I've got the clay, I've got the stone. We just need log stakes, which means we need 12 pieces of wood. And that's it. That's all we need to do. Okay, that is our goal for today. We can always use our Nook Master Kit another time. What did I get? No more loan payments. Oh, thousand. Very cool. Anything else? Whoop. Yeah, there it is. Oh, yeah, because we've just been here for three days. A few more miles. Why not? A few more miles for chilling out. Oh, I got to... Um, I was super frustrated. I got to... Where's my fish? Yeah, I got to 55 this time, so I got the second one, but again, fell well short of the 100. In my defense, part of the problem was I was trying to fish in the sea, and actually different fish are harder to catch. Um, they give you less time. 
The, the problem with the fishing is when the fish drops under the water really quickly, you have to hit A really quickly to catch the fish, right? You, you genuinely have to be fairly speedy, and the harder to catch fish, you have to be even speedier. So, I missed a couple of them, because I was shopping in a big district. Did that make any sense? <laughs> right, I want to check my storage. Yeah, there's the clay. There's the stone. And there's some... I, I tell you what, we are not a million miles away. Oh. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? It's the middle of the day, though. Let's make it nice and bright. Okay, I want to move. Is there a better way to do this? There's got to be a better way to do this. Oh, I'll, just, I'll just keep all of it. I really don't want to. It'd be nice to split the stack somehow, but... I don't see a button for it, so I'm going to ignore it for now. Let's make sure it's not gone in. Yeah, okay. So yeah, we've got a fossil there. Um, I wanted you guys to be part of the appraisal process because it's pretty cool. So I kept it, unfortunately. We've got a couple more fish in here. We've got the citrus longhorn beetle. I only got that last night as well for the first time. There's our barred knife jaw, our football fish, and our ore fish. And then, of course, all of these in here also need to go in the museum. Right, so all we need then is, I believe, five pieces of wood if we're going to do this. Yeah? Yeah, so, axe out. Swing. <laughs> this just looks like an axe murderer, it really does. Now, I believe, I'm going to do this. That was a mistake. I can only hit the trees twice now, because the axe will actually knock them out. Um, I wonder if that will grow. I'm going to leave that there. Only twice. Only twice. You could knock them down and then replant them, but... Maybe that's something I'll do later, but for now, I'm just going to... Try to get 12. Oh, to 11. One more piece already. We are cooking with petroleum. There it is. Give it a good old smack for luck. There you love stuff. Right. Feeling good. Let's nip over to our crafting bench, which is down here at the... Oh, look at those. I wonder if they're going to be in the middle. There's a thing where if you water flowers, um, they can geminate a new... Uh, flavor, <laughs> new color, basically. So a red and yellow, you just should make like an orange one. So I'm curious to see if we've actually managed that. The hope is eventually as well to make some. Oh, this is gonna take bloody ages. Is to make some. Um... Okay, one just thing I want to complain about. Let us please let us craft multiple objects at once. Like, let me just. I need to make four of these. Why don't you just let me make four of them instantly, right? <laughs> it's so ridiculous that you can't do that. It honestly is. It's a bizarre choice. Here we go. <laughs> Um, the plan is to set up like proper orchard and stuff around the rest of the island. Make it, you know, nice and fancy. So that might be done by the next video, so keep an eye out for that next time around. I'll, of course, show it if it happens. One more. <laughs> if you tap the... is it A? Yeah, if you tap A when it's crafting, he, that's when he goes... <laughs> it goes insane. He does speed it up a little bit, but not, not too much. There we go. Look at that. Bridge construction kit, very cool. Now, he said it can be a little finicky to place, but I'm going to assume that he's just being stupid. In, I don't want people... Right, you're not going to be able to walk down here, so it can't go here, because that's my house. And I don't want it to be... I think he is probably a good spot, right? Let's, let's give this a go. Let's see if we can do this. Right. This might be... Um, an issue. I think it probably has to be over here, you know. I actually don't think there's another location. Other than right behind my house, I don't believe there's another location where this will work. So, let's go in here, I guess. Let's do it. Huzzah! Everything takes a day. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so it's far enough away from this house, at least. Mine, mine's, like, right by the river. You can't even see it from here. So that's, that's good. A little showcase here. Some lovely, lovely planting going on. Our coconuts are on their way up. Any little dwarfs? Nope. Ah, oh, look at the lighting coming up as well. Lovely. Any little dwarfs? What? Wharfs. Wharfs is what I meant. <laughs> Everyone's got really nice houses. Oh, God. Right. So... So, 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 what time is it? How long have I been recording? Tell you what, we're going to hop over to another island, because I've got the ticket, and we can do a little collection. Um, what's my inventory looking like? 
Yeah, that's fine. Okay, that's okay. Maybe we'll meet someone new. Maybe we'll find some new, you know, animals. Who knows? Let's go on a little explore. What I'd really like to find is actually another fruit. Um, it's it's quite hard to get new fruit. We found coconuts, and I got pears because they got delivered by Mama like earlier on in the game. And fruit sells for a lot more on islands where it's not native. So peaches are native to our island. We've got peaches everywhere. Unfortunately, that means peaches aren't worth much, but if we can plant another fruit, like the pears, or hopefully something I'm going to find now, then we can sell those for a lot more, and plant some trees from them, you know? Let's go! I should say, I should really have said it at the start of the video, I get a lot of comments, which I really appreciate, you know, people commenting down below, and giving me advice, and all this kind of jazz. But, it's worth remembering, I'm probably three or four episodes ahead when it comes to Animal Crossing, and most three or four days ahead. It's kind of like playing Portia again. It's just because sometimes you have to do multiple in a day, you know? Cheese bulbs. Alright, let's have a little peek around. What have we got? We have peaches. Because of course we do. <laughs> oh, we've got a big fish though. Oh, it's not that big. And a Oh, she's so cute! Alright, let me, let me grab this fish. Hopefully. Wait for it. Yeah, black bass. Yellow perch. <laughs> okay, well, not seen that. That was that. Oh, I guess you missed me. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Not too bad. You know what? It's hard to complain getting four rind nuggets from one rock. That's not bad at all. And we can pop some fruit and smash this up. We'll have a little explore. I can always take back some pansies and plant them. I think I've only got... Yeah... I don't think I've got any, actually, in my garden, so... Ooh! Ooh! And tell you what we have here, ladies and gentlemen. We have... A fossil, potentially. Yeah! There we go! Now, unfortunately, we can't get it analysed till tomorrow, but that does mean we've got two analysis tomorrow. So yellow butterfly, yellow butterfly. This is a very disappointing island. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Mrs. Bear. I'm sure you're lovely, but the island is rubbish. There's just nothing here that I don't already have. I guess part of the reason you come here... I'm kind of treating it because I'm looking for the fruit, and I'm looking for new animals, and I'm looking for... Uh, I mean, all is very helpful. But it really is. This is the point, right? What you're really here for is resource gathering. You know, you're, there's only like three rocks on our entire island. So they're quite hard to get, generally speaking, rocks. It's a river. Yeah. I wonder if I can get across there. Hey, love. Tutu. Hi, Tutu. She said of somebody Trey Cool is from there. Oh! Oh, Tutu, you old flirt. Tutu, I've had... I, I love you, but I've had this exact same conversation with someone else. <laughs> Doing it forever. Yeah. And eventually, she's going to be so calm that she'll melt into a Tutu-shaped puddle. Everyone's a pop star. There it is. <laughs> She's very cute, though. You, what are you? Oh, you're, you're chill. Um, yeah, so unfortunately, I can't get across there, can I? I'd like to get up there, really, but it's not going to happen. We need ladders. So really, all we got was a little bit of, um, I'll, I'll gather all the wood as well. You know, we'll, we'll chop down all the trees just because... That's the point, right? You have limited resources on your own island, especially in terms of rocks, more than anything else. Rocks are actually quite hard to come by, so that's probably the main reason we're going to travel. Tutu, I'm going to smash your island to smithereens, love. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, I've got achievement for that as well. She's very cute. She's not wearing pants. Maybe she should wear pants. She's kind of uh, thick, though, right? A little bit? Anyone else feeling that with Tutu? No? no? Okay. Right, anyways, we are going to... Yeah, good time to end it there, then. Well, let's check what this uh, new mouse thing is, and then we'll go from there. Oh! New dailies, of course. 
What do we have to do then? We have to collect bugs, we have to pop a balloon, we have to sell shells by the seashore, and we have to catch fish. And that's it. That one's a bargain, that one. Okay, good stuff. So, lots to do today, already done. I will probably spend my day gathering a little bit more money. You know, we've got a big debt to pay off. I suspect we can probably pay it off tomorrow. And tomorrow, what I'll do is, I'll start the video a little bit later, hopefully. Uh, let me think about this. I'll do it in two parts. I'd like to show you guys the shop and stuff like that. Um, so we'll do that tomorrow. We're going to see the museum tomorrow for the very first time. We're going to have an upgraded house. And we're going to have a completed bridge. So there's a lot going on tomorrow. There really is. As for this, I'll probably just wander around the island, smash some rocks up, catch a fish or two, and then, unfortunately, head home. Maybe murder 2-2 two -two with an axe. Depends how I'm feeling. Until that next video, then, thank you so much for joining me, ladies and gentlemen. I'll see you folks then. Cheers much of as always. Bye-bye.